Hello guys, welcome back to another video. Today's video is only a short video and it's about the light switch. I've had a few people actually asking me about the two plate wiring, um, you know, how it's wired and so on. So I've already done the first fix in this property, so I'm about to do the second fix. And what I've done here is I put the feed into the switch and I've actually feed out to the next room and I've got the light feed here as well. Instead of bringing it to the ceiling and then looping out to the other room and then bringing another cable into the switch. Whereas I've done it the other way where both the feed in and feed out from the switch. It's a lot easier in the future if there was ever any fault or when we're doing a testing. We can always come to the switch and we can all diagnose the problems and whatever. So it's a lot easier, especially being a bedroom or if you're doing it you know, on the first floor. If there's a bed in the middle of the room and the light switch, uh, the light pendants in the middle of the room as well, so it's it's a nightmare moving the bed and getting the ladder up. And well, what I find it is easier doing it this way. And so today I'm going to be installing this one. I'll get the camera close up and I'll do the wiring. Guys, I need your help. I need you to help me grow this channel. Those of you who have subscribed, thank you so much. And those of you who haven't, if you're the first time please subscribe and hit the like button, uh, button. So I'll get the camera uh, close up and I'll do the wiring. So what I have here is I've got the, this one here is the, for the lights in the ceiling. And these, this one here is the light coming in and this is the one light going out. So let's say this is the feed in and this is the feed out and that's the lights in the ceiling. So what I've done is I've actually stripped this one, I'm just going to strip this one here as well. So now, I say this is the light, so I'm just going to leave that here and I'm going to split them up, separate them, get my CPC all sleeved up. Got the CPC, so I'm just going to put it in the sleeves and connect them together. So I've got them, I'm just going to get the Wago connectors and I'm going to put them in. So got that out the way. So yeah, this is my light. So I'm gonna put all the neutrals together. Have another way you go. So now I've got the all neutrals together, and I've got the CPC together. Now on the switch, you have Sometimes it says COM and you got L1, L2. So, um, or sometimes you have L and L1, L2. So this one here, it doesn't really matter. I mean, uh, I'm, I'll be putting this on the top, which is the L 
L and then this will be the L1. Just gonna shrink this back a little bit and then do that. Hope you get good connections on them. Yeah, so they're ready. I'm gonna grab the switch. So I've got the L and I've got the L1. So I'm gonna put these two together. The L1. Sorry, L, sorry. Uh, sometimes you have, um, so it's calm. So I've got them together now. Now I'm going to put this one, which is the light uh, that goes into the ceiling, into the L1. So they're all in. Yeah, so I'm ready to put the screw in and power up. I uh, should be working. So um, I'll, I've got the camera close up now and I'll show you what I've done. So I've got the CPC all uh, together and also I've got the all neutrals together as well. And whereas I've got the feed in and feed out, the light goes into the L and also the light feed onto the L1. So I'd say it's quite a simple process and um, if you get the hang of it, it's, qu it's quite quick as well. Thank you so much guys, thank you for watching this video. If you like the video, please share the video, please hit the like button. And those of you who haven't subscribed, please subscribe, help me uh, channel grow. Thank you guys.